Hello and welcome from Caravan Salon 2021. This is the Foster Living Up camper van and it costs 42,240, 541, which also coincidentally happens to be the amount of centimeters long it is, 205 wide, and it's two, it doesn't say here, but I know it's 268 tall. And uh, what it comes with is a table that you can remove and put outside, and that is living up. Sounds like something from McDonald's to me. Uh, let's have a brief look inside. Well, it's a very short camper van, but it's got a lot of uh, stuff in it. Um, well, that you might need in a camper van. So, got a bed here, and the bed is contoured around the toilet to, to get the maximum amount of space in it possible. There you are, pretty big uh, storage facility there, and at the other side as well. And this one comes with a hole in it. So in that case, it's got the hole in it there. You can remove that bit and you might want to take the shelf out if you're going to use it as a wardrobe. So just some advice from me. Maybe you wouldn't, but uh, who knows? And there you have a more standard type shelf. Um, let's have a look in here. This is, this is the wet room. This is a toilet, actually you use these things here to use the toilet and you can also use it to clean yourself up with. Look how, look how, uh, uh, <laughs> how much room there is, how much room is. And it comes with this here, it's for a horrible curtain around. Hey, that'd be great if you like getting stuck to a curtain in when the shower. Uh, this is the sink. There you go, there's the sink. So, I mean, on the whole, 541 centimetres in length, it's not too bad. I'd just like to point out today, I'm advertising Panda Camp, uh, which is a rental company in Gliwice in Poland. So thanks to Camp Panda Camp for supporting me with this t-shirt. If not, I'd have had nothing to wear today. So, uh, coming out. Right, well, you know, you can take the table out here because it gives you more room when you're uh, sitting in here and uh, you're driving. Well, not if you're driving, you're sitting in the back of this, you probably, you can put the table up there, for example. Uh, and bearing in mind the length of this thing, 541, it isn't a footprint much larger than that of many cars. You know what, I can feel the, I can feel the vibrations from the fridge. Or maybe it's me. Maybe it's an earthquake taking place. Anyway, well, that feels something anyway. Two burners, you wouldn't expect any more in a van of this nature. Nice big wide drawers. Let's have a look down here, see if they've got any uh, problem. Let down by not having proper sides to them. And here we've got one of these new, well, newish now, Dometic fridges, the magic ones. They open both ways, opens like that. And it opens like that. Now, it's supposed to open like that. Now somebody wrote and said they tried opening one at the Birmingham Trade Fair and uh, it fell off. Um, that hasn't happened to me, but uh, I don't know, maybe somebody broke it, who knows. Oh, I've got the storage down here, but this, yeah, you see? A lot there as well. Can you see that? Now this thing here is going to cost 43000 and to my way of thinking, getting something like this makes more sense than these camping cars I see a lot of built in the Ford Transit Custom, which is all the rage at present. And uh, with that in mind, uh, let's walk around the back. You see, it's, the, okay, the width of it, 206, 205, uh, it, that might be a little bit of a problem for most people, but I think the length most drivers could manage relatively well. What do you think's in here? The boiler's there, the top, you can tell the boiler's there actually, it's got this, it's got a grill. And this is the gas cupboard. There you go. Foster's a, as a brand has been on the go for, oh, I don't know, but 
can't be 10 years because I've had a thing for the 10th anniversary. It's probably like eight years or something like that. And oh, I'll show you another thing here you can do. Look at that, this will come up like that. Or you can remove it completely. That, that, that uh, actually wasn't held, probably should have been held in these things, but I think, I think that was, that's to be understood. And that can come out, and you put a bicycle down there, for example, you make a bed for the night. Uh, all, uh, all pretty good. Anyway, um, walk around the outside. Now, I happen to notice, whilst I was on this Foster camper van stand, that uh, they were closing all the vans down. But I didn't get kicked out of this van that I'm in. Normally come, they come and say rudely to you, as you're filming, you gotta go. But that didn't happen here, so that's a positive mark. That actually, when you sort of got somebody like me doing films, uh, which in most cases tend to be free advert advertising for the company, well, as I tell the truth, uh, I can understand them wanting to kick me off, but uh, most people just do the sort of the advertising stuff. And um, so uh, you didn't kick me off, so that was, that, that, was, that was very nice. But you see you've got a number of vans here in the Foster series, all of which are a similar price level. Some of them are a bit more, this one here is a bit more, but uh, it's a similar sort of thing. Uh, it's meant to be sort of the colour scheme is meant to su su suggest youth and uh, dynamism. So this this green and the black, the black looks like a rose, uh, green looks as though it's fresh. That's the idea behind it. Um, a bright colour. It's like when mobile phone companies use bright colours. That means they're aiming it at a younger, the younger set. And when they use serious colours like black, it normally indicates. Uh, quality but business sort of thing as a general rule so here they've mixed the two and uh, anyway so I can only just take you on the outside because they've closed everything but you can see it's got a rather large uh, family of living up vans in the three sizes 541 599 and 636 centimeters that's the long one Right, so I'll come take you back now to the one I started off with. And uh, it says up there, best van in class, but that's referring to Malibu, not to, uh, not to Foster. So, uh, I think this is, you know, it's, a, it's an option, it's a, an inexpensive option. I don't think it's such a bad idea. And uh, anyway, it says there, AB. Ab means from 37,950. You're not going to find one at that price. There aren't any at that price. It's totally impossible to find one at that price. But, 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 you might find a dealer who will knock it down to that price, which isn't quite the same thing. Thanks for watching. I hope you found that interesting. And all the best from Dusseldorf.